Dia de los Muertos is coming soon, and AARP has some senior workshops that you can take to get in the spirit. And we are joined today by John Vasquez, AARP volunteer and Guadalupe Cultural Arts Center's Jorge Pina to learn more. Gentlemen, good Hello. afternoon. Good afternoon. Okay, we always think of, you know, Dia de los Muertos and the sugar skulls and all the great decorations, but there's a lot more to it and what you brought here, Jorge, right? Yes, that's correct. Uh, and this is an altar. This is a portable altar. You can make altars at home or you can get involved with galleries and or cultural centers throughout the city and create your own altar. Mm -hmm. And the altares are is a strong gathering for family members and friends to come together and have memory of the ones that have passed on. Now, obviously you have pictures and that mm -hmm. seems kind of obvious to have, but you also have beans and rice and corn. What's, what's that significant? It's uh, Mother Earth, mm -hmm. and through us, la vida nuestra, la vida de, este, de la tierra. So uh, this represents life, and so with life, there's death, and that's where we bring it all together. Okay. You can have also other items. Uh, let's say a certain person enjoys a certain kind of candy, you bring the candy, or a certain kind of dish. Uh, last year, we had one señora brought a whole plato of enchiladas. You know, as part of the uh, that. I like that kind. Yeah. <laughs> all right, and that's what AARP is doing. We've got a workshop coming up to learn right. all about this. And if you've never really done one before, learn the history of it and just have a good time too, right? That is correct. We've extended Hispanic Heritage Month another few weeks. Okay. And what we're doing is having two presentations, one on how to do sugar skulls. That'll be tomorrow. Right. Uh, and then a week later, we're doing another one on how you can do your own altar. Now, when you come to do the altar one, bring your own personal effects, things like maybe photos or favorite foods of the person that you want to honor. And that way, we'll make a community altar, and you'll be able to see it with other person's events. You'll meet new friends. You'll be involved in activity. You'll learn how to do it. And that's why AARP has workshops like this, because you have these, what, a couple of them a month, maybe? Or oh, we, we do. Actually, if you'll go to our webpage, aarp.org slash San Antonio, and you'll find all our events are right there. You can register for the events on that page. There's also a phone number to call. You can do that as well. Mm -hmm. But the, the web page will show you everything, and there's things coming up all the time. And your, your member and their guests can show up and be there and enjoy and learn. And like you said, meet, just be, just have a, get outside, have a good time, right? And, and learn something too. Oh, yeah. And you were telling me that uh, it depends on where you're from in Mexico as to right. what type of altar that you make? Well, right, depends on what nation you're from. Like there's some villages up in the mountains of Oaxaca that'll do a whole month of celebration before the Los Muertos. And you have other areas that do the Los Muertos just the day of, mm -hmm. which is November 2nd. And other areas, November 1st is for the children, November 2nd is for adults. It all depends what area. For us, for us Chicanos from uh, Texas, we celebrate it by uh, uh, creating contemporary altares, because you have some altares that are very traditional, seven levels, you have to have uh, the marigolds, the, the water, the smoke, et cetera, on and on, very traditional. And, but for some of us, it's a, a form of expression. And so here, like let's say uh, you had a company member that was a dancer, obviously you would put the shoes in the okay. altar, or a costume uh, here, or a guitar. And just those little special right. things that you may have saved about somebody and yes. paying tribute to them. And what okay. happens is, once you start talking, a memory comes. And now your spirit of your friend is here with you. Oh, that's wonderful. All right, well, there are two workshops, one happening tomorrow, and that's the Sugar Skulls, like yes. you said, and then again on Thursday, October 24th, and you can check out all of AARP's events at aarp.org slash San Antonio, or you can give them a call at 877-926-8300.